Good morning, Code Bakers. Today is going to be a great day. George is walking around his virtual world and we're going to enable collisions. If you're stuck, remember that you can freely download the source code for the starting point of this tutorial. We're first going to move the friend group loader into a separate file so that you can use this file as a template when you load the obstacles. Create a new file under the subfolder loaders called load underscore friends dot dart. I'm going to change the name in a second here. Go into main dot dart. Isolate the portion of the code that is loading the friend group. So there's only two friends and it loads the TMX file earlier and stores it in home map. And once you have the home map, you can extract the layer which is the object group layer friends. Then cut and paste it from main.dart into this new file, add underscore friends.dart. Pay attention to what the different lines mean because we will have a challenge where you have to create the obstacle component on your own. Are you paying attention, Code Baker? So let's convert this into a function that we can call from the main.dart file. This will be the same challenge when you build the obstacle uh, component loader. So let's call it load friends. So it's a little bit clearer than just add friends. Tiled component is from flame tiled. We're going to accept a home map. The home map is loaded in main.dart and it passes it over to load friends. We're also going to pass the entire game over so we can get all access to the variables and methods. So pay attention to what the different lines mean. You're going to have to change the variable names, especially in the for loop, when you build the obstacle component on your own shortly. Uh, that friend component is a separate file, which you'll also need to build for obstacle component and we'll have to import it. So that friend component we built earlier, it's going to pass it the game. One of the reasons for isolating this in a separate file is that if you break the code when you do your own challenge, you can just comment out the uh, call to this particular function. So back in main.dart, we're going to create uh, different lines to load the uh, different components, the baked goods, the character, uh, the friends, and the obstacle components. So right now we're focused on loading the friends. So we'll add this line, which calls the function that we just created. Since we isolated out this load friends into a separate file, uh, you know, if there was a problem, we could then comment out this line and not load the friends, then focus then we know the problem is within that load friends file. In this case, everything is working as expected. Get ready to pause the video after this explanation. This is your challenge. In the lib slash characters folder, create a new file called obstacle underscore component dot dart. Use friend underscore component as a template and modify it um, you know, you have to create a new file, right? So in the new file, modify the friend underscore component portion so that you can load the obstacles. You don't need the on collision method at this point. We'll add it in in the future. However, you do need the has hit boxes and collidable. We want that purple bounding box to appear, but you don't need to detect for collision right now, although you could take that as an additional challenge. In the lib slash loaders folder, create a new file, load underscore obstacles dot dart, and then use the file load underscore friends dot dart, which we just created as a template. And you, you need to change the variables, you know, especially that for loop. Just be careful when you loading that for loop and load the obstacles. Then go back into main dot dart. And remember to add or to call the function from main.dart to load the components. Okay, Code Baker, it's your time. Pause the video and give it a shot. 
In the left hand pane, select the characters folder, then create a new file. And let's call that file obstacle underscore component dot dart. Let's go right to the friend component and copy everything down. So to select all, copy, and we'll paste it right into the obstacle component dot dart file. Delete the contents of the on collision because we'll take a different action when the collision has started. We'll leave the super dot on collision in here. We can delete the import statement for the dialog box. We can now change the friend component to obstacle component and uh, make sure you delete that F. In the constructor on line seven, delete, uh, delete friend and put obstacle component. Remember the constructor is just a function with the same name as the class that runs automatically. Okay, great job. We've completed the first four steps of our little challenge here. So we'll just check it off and cross it off our list. We've also added the add hit boxes. Because we copied it from the friend component, it already had these mix-ins for has hit boxes and collidables. Let's now tackle the next two pieces, which is adding the loader to lib loaders. In the loaders folder, let's create a new file called load underscore obstacles dot dart. We will copy the contents from load underscore friends into the new file that we create. After we copy the contents from load underscore friends into our new file, load underscore obstacles dot dart, we'll need to make several changes. Remember that the name of the layer is a text string that we specified in the open source map maker tiled. In addition to changing the name of the function and the variables, the critical part is this obstacle's word has to be the exact match from happy underscore map dot tmx. It might be somewhat buried in there. In mine, it's on line 31, but you did set it within tiled. It just has to be the exact match of this layer that we set up in tiled. For the rest of them, you can do a replace. Under the edit menu, select replace and we'll search for friend in the top box and in the box below that we will put obstacle and we'll select replace all on line 11 the name of our position component is a capital o obstacle so everything is correct there except it should be capital o because it's a class and by convention the class has a capitalized first letter Back in the main.dart file, look for the section where you're loading the baked goods and your friends, and let's add in the load obstacles. Instead of passing it the game, because we're in flame game, we'll just pass it this. Now let's run our code and test it. Beautiful. We now have the purple bounding boxes around the obstacles that we selected. We created these obstacles with tiled. We're not stopping the movement yet. We'll take care of that in the next video. Fantastic. Subscribe to the channel for updates on the more than 50 videos I've made on Flame. The videos with source code are also available for free on Teachable, 100% free course. This is a hobby. In whatever way you choose to learn, make sure you have fun and unleash your creativity. Have a fantastic day.